Hi guys, this is Jason here from Nathaniel and let's learn the popular Bollywood song Milne Hai Mujh Se Aai. So basically it's on the key of D major which has two sharps. So let's just go through that D major, D, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, D. Now it also feels like it's on B minor because B minor is the relative minor of D major. But the chords of this song, if you know the chords of D major, you're pretty much fine to figure them out in this song. So if you take all the D major chords, you have D major, which is the one major. You have G major, which is the four major. You have A major, which is the five. Then you have E minor, which is the two. F sharp minor which is the 3 and B minor which is the 6. So there is a strong focus on the 6 minor. The 6 minor is B minor, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So because the B minor seems to be there at a lot of the starting points of the song and also feels like the root of the song, we say the song's on the key of B minor. Okay? So the song has... A lot of sections actually. There's a verse, the hook part, a pre-chorus where there's some chanting going on. Then there's another verse which is quite rare. You'll not have that in like a western song. And then you'll have another pre-chorus and you have an interlude or an intro or an instrumental part where the guitarist plays that hook. Right? Then you have a bridge which sort of is a build up to the guitar solo. The guitar solo also has a lot of chords. And then it comes back to the verse. So in this uh, tutorial, what I'm going to talk about is mainly all the singing parts, but the guitar solo and the bridge and all that have also been written down. So I'd suggest to also go over to the our folder where you will have the access to the chord chart of the entire structure. So what we are going to do in the video is the, the vocal parts. So let's first do the main hook of the song with uh, Nupur who's helping me uh, in this video, right? So let's do verse one, please. Shall we? Yeah. yeah. One, two, three, go. Change to A major. G major. F sharp. One more time. E minor. A major. G major. F sharp. Right? So let me just show you the chords again. The chords change every bar. So you can do B minor four times. So four times means you're on the pulse. One, two, three, four. Change the chord. Two, three, four. Change the chord like that. So basically by default, every chord changes after four beats unless otherwise mentioned in the chord chart. So the verse one is basically this. So you on the piano, you could do four chord hits in the right hand and you could do one chord hit in the left hand. Otherwise, it becomes very busy. So it's sort of like a one is to four between the left hand and the right hand. So let me just show you that once on the keyboard. So you have one, two, three, four, change, two, three, four, change, two, three, four, change, two, three, four. Na, 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 change. So what are these chords again? B minor, A major, A C sharp E, G major, but the way I am playing G major is a little bit of color. I am playing B, D and F sharp and playing G in the left hand. So it becomes like a very jazzy sound or a G major 7th for those of you who know the bigger voicings. This is how you can get a major 7th. You do B, D, F sharp in the right hand and do G in the left hand. <clears throat> so A 
G which is in this way okay and the way i'm playing f sharp major is also quite interesting instead of just playing f sharp major like this what i'm doing is so b c sharp e okay makes it a very interesting mysterious sound and then it goes back to normal f sharp major so that's sort of a suspended f sharp major and then a normal f sharp major so that doesn't really happen in the song but uh, i think it's something you can consider adding so let's go through this again and let's try and do it with the vocals please 2 3 4 <laughs> b minor <laughs> a major <laughs> g major <laughs> f sharp sus f sharp sus major <laughs> Take it slightly slower. Is pal meri ladai. Is G major seven. F sharp, right? So that's pretty much section one. So I would suggest to maybe pause the video, try to get used to the chords, and then move over to section two. So the section two, what I'm calling. a uh, section 2 which it appears in the song is the pre chorus or the chanting part where there is not too many lyrical things it's just wo right so let's try and do that part together shall we 2 3 <laughs> there so when you're doing that part it's the chords change a bit fast so you go wo ho d e a g e a wo ho so every chord is marked out for two beats as you can see here when i which i've put this symbol 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 so that happens twice d a g a d a g a right and uh, after that we go into a very sort of sustained part so let's do the o part and then go to the next part after that 1 2 0 a major g a major B minor. Okay. So that generally happens once, right, throughout uh, the piece. So you always end that o part with a very sustained part. So that's A major, B minor, A major, and then G major seventh, which I've showed you guys earlier, where you do G and B D F sharp in the right hand. B minor, na na na, A major, G G major seventh. Okay, and then based on the song, it continues to go back to the verse part again, and then uh, there's a guitar part as well. Let's just finish off the guitar part because that guitar part happens very often, right? So the guitar part I've written down here, which is like the interlude or intro. Na 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 Okay, and then it goes to the next vocal verse, which is a what you could call as verse two, I guess, in the song. Okay, so we've now covered the main hook, the verse one or the in, starting vocal part. Then we've done the chanting part. Then we've done the breakdown part. Now let's do the next verse. Uh, we'll do it first with the vocals, and then I'll try to tell you the chords. But in verse two, just look out for the chords to change a little faster than verse one. Verse one, it was one, two, three, four. 
four, right? Na 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 na. So the chords is every four counts. Verse two, it's gonna be a little faster. Na 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 na. One. It's going to change faster. So let's see how verse two will sound with the chord changes. Two, three, sing. Jaane kyu main sochta ho khali samay ek raasta ho tune mujhe kahi khud diya hai ya me kahi khud shabda ho. Okay, we'll come back to the next continuation. So if you see B minor, A. G major, F sharp minor, B minor, A G, F sharp minor. So you see, it gets repeated just like how verse one had B minor, A major, G major, F sharp major. You have B minor, A major, G major, F sharp minor. But then the chords change a bit fast, and there's no F sharp major. Okay, so it's into two, and then let's move on to the next part. Two, three, four. and then it goes back to the hook right okay let's do that part once more and then i'll call out the chords first na 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 that part 2 3 <laughs> go a major i don't le tu phir mujhe e minor a major again kas me bhi do to e minor f sharp back to the hook which is then you also have that uh, bridge part and the guitar solo i'll play that for you guys once uh, probably in a little bit faster way because uh, you may get too confused with so many parts in this song but nevertheless all the chords are written down in the chart so i'd advise you all to click the link in the description and head over and download it okay and it's free so just get it okay so let's do the bridge very very quickly <clears throat> so b minor dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. there's like a synth part then it goes to d So that's a nice chord A with C sharp and a D with a C sharp uh, with a C bass mm, uh, B sus4 so whenever you have these slash chords like A with C sharp bass means you play A major here and you need the bass guitar of your band or on the left hand of the piano or on the last note of the guitar you need to be playing the C sharp here so oh, A with C sharp with c bass and then it takes you to b sus and the guitar solo g major uh, f sharp minor then f major 7th f major 7th c with e bass a dun, 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 dun. and it goes back to the singing part right so that instrumental part is also quite cool the chords are completely different so if ever you're doing that with your band uh, you can refer to the entire chord progression right so this is milne hai mujse aayi again thanks to nupur for being part of the video and singing so amazingly well cheers and catch you in the next video